Okay guys, today we're going to be looking at Bugprog 4 Beta. It's been released and uh, for all you guys who have not yet got it, I would advise you to look for it and uh, just try it out on the VMware. Now, today I'm going to be passing through the basics of uh, Bugprog 4, how to start it up because it's not like Bugprog 3 and uh, it's a lot of version that's Bugprog 2. Uh, it's easy to start up, you just boot it up and the network, you know, the networking role will be just um, the unit for card will be lightly detected, which is not the case in here. So we first log in with the password root or with a we first log in with a uh, user with a login as root and then the password as tar that is a T O T T double O R then it loads wait oh, oh it says I've given it a room password let me just try it again root and then tar right it functions very well so I need to configure my my my, my network card so I, I, I type sla mm, as in a forward slash etc forward slash init dot d slash networking hmm. this sounds easy then start then enter so it's configuring it right now when it's done, we can now start our. Here you have two options about our. Uh, the, there's another problem of our screen resolution uh, for in regards of those people who are using it on a VMware, on a, a visual, a, 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 a virtual machine like maybe VMware. You have to fix your screen resolution, otherwise it will be a very big burden to you. Uh, I would advise you you use fix VM fix VM VMware so that it fixes it automatically but there is also another way I'm going to show it to you once we get inside so there are two ways you can either start it in a in the GUI in the GUI mod or in the in the crystal mod that is um, BT, BT from back, back truck for or BT4 s um, slash uh, no it's just right up here let me just show it to you it's just right up here you just type in this and uh, or you can start it in the uh, the, the K KDE mod. So we I'm just going to use to, to start with the GUI mod. But truck four, I just start. So start X, and it will uh, just load up. So here we go. There we are, and uh, we can see it. It starts up just like this. Not much of a difference, but. Uh, there are lots and lots of added features inside here but now not to forget of where we were at the, the last time is that we, we were discussing about how we can uh, change our resolution if we didn't use the the fix vm all you have to type is x rand x rand r to see the options and these are the different options i'm just going to give you an example uh, since in case i decide to select this i say copy and um, I want that as my screen resolution. I say X rand, X rand R. I I hold a Shift Enter, uh, Shift Insert minus S. Shift Insert was the to paste minus S. But when I hit Enter, it will just configure it. But the problem now I'm having is that I had already auto fixed it with a fixed VMware, so I can't change it for now. So guys, I. I believe you have uh, quite some pieces of bug track and uh, keep uh, keep on my my tube because uh, I'm going to load more tutorials about bug track and how it can be used. Thank you.